उनको उनसे भी मैं अनुरोध करूंगा वो लोग थोड़ा सा अपना अनुभव बताए अनुभव बताने के पहले मैं एक व्याख्या करना चाहता हूँ करण सिंह जी राजा भी था और मंत्री भी था राजा और मंत्री भी और जनार्दन द्विवेदी जी लीडर भी था बाद में रीडर भी हो गया सो so, इन दोनों में टू इन वन गुण है मैं अनुरोध करूंगा डॉक्टर साहब से करण सिंह जी से अपना विचार सदन के साथ शेयर थैंक यू मिस्टर सर एज इज बीन वेरी काइंडली मैं हाफ ए सेंचुरी गो फिफ्टी ईयर्स गो आई केम टू डेली आफ्टर हैविंग सर्व माई होम स्टेट एज हेड ऑफ द स्टेट फॉर एटीन ईयर्स फिफ्टी ईयर्स गो एट एज ऑफ थर्टी सिक्स आई केम टू डेली एंड जॉइन मिसिज गांधी कैबिनेट एंड फॉर दीज फिफ्टी ईयर्स आउट ऑफ दैम फोर्टी ईयर्स आई हैव बीन अ मेंबर ऑफ पार्टी फोर टाइम्स इन द लोकसभा and four times in the dance most of the treasury benches and in the opposition in both houses and it is it has been fascinating to see the evolution of parliament over all these years and how our constitution gives us the flexibility to adapt to changing economic social and political compulsions there is also we witnessed a explosion in the media for example when we started there were two channels now there are 500 channels that has also changed the complexion of our, of our politics and parliament has evolved sir over these 50 years but not all the changes have been positive i must say i mean i used to remember when i went to the lok sabha first there were brilliant debates hiran mukherji with the, the madhule bhai with nath pai with atul ji and here bhupesh gupta those sort of debates now seem to me to be becoming rare and the disruptions are becoming more frequent so all i would say is that i think we need to do a little retrospection to see what we can do to assure that the parliamentary system functions according to the rules and positively so looking back at this vast panorama of half a century i had the privilege of interacting with a huge spectrum of political colleagues from every region every religion every caste every community i was a witness to or participant in every single general election since 1952 and i had the uh, privilege of interacting as gulab nand ji said with all the prime ministers when i was up in jammu and kashmir my mentor pandit jawahar lal nehru and lal bahadur shastri ji and when i came here of course श्रीमती इंदिरा गांधी राजीव गांधी पी वी नरसिंह राव अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी डॉक्टर मनमोहन सिंह जी पी एल एंड नाउ नरेंद्र भाई मोदी सो दिस इज बीन अ ग्रेट एक्सपीरियंस फॉर मी एंड आई नोटिस वन थिंग सर डिस्पाइट शार्प डिफरेंसेस ऑफ ओपिनियन एंड ऑफ आइडियोलॉजी वेरी ऑफन एक्सप्रेस इन इन टेम्परेट लैंग्वेज वन थिंग इज कॉमन इन ऑल दीज थी दे वर ओल्ड इन देर ओन वे वर्किंग फॉर वॉट पंडित जवाहरलाल नेहरू कॉल्ड the exciting adventure of building a new india in their own way every prime minister uh, who has made a contribution so our ours is a unique unique and glorious country from the himalayas from where i come kalidasa you are aware sir asputrasyam vishidevatatma himalayo nam nagadiraja purva parvato yanidhi vagaya sthitah prithvya eva manavata is a devatatma is a great uh, the great spiritual presence and alama akmal has said wo parvat sabse uncha hum saaya aasman ka wo paasaba hamara wo santri hamara so the himalayas have, have, have really in a way uh, laid down the parameters of what india has all the way down to kanyakumari where three great oceans meet at the feet of mother india and what a unique country so much diversity of, of religion of language of custom of food of of dress of ideologies but we have coped with this diversity by basing ourselves on our constitutional and civilizational values and i would submit sir that if properly presented there is no conflict between these for example we talk of secularism one line of the of the veda ekam sat vipra bahuda vadanti the truth is one the wise call it by many names sarva dharma samabhav that is our view of secularism it's not anti religious 
We cannot be anti-religious in this country, except perhaps some people whose ideology may, may, may force them to be anti-religious. Otherwise, that is Ishwara Sarvabhutana Vidyesha Tishtati. The Lord resides in the heart of all beings, not in any particular caste or creed or country. That's what the Gita tells us. And socialism, again, one word, one line, Bahujana Sukhaya, Bahujana Hitayati. What better definition? Sarve Pisukena Santu, Sarve Santu Nidamaya, Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu, Makashti Tukabhag Bhavi. I think even my good friend D. Raja will agree there's no better uh, definition of socialism than this. <laughs> and as far as freedoms are concerned, sir, Ano Bhadra Kritu Yantu Vishwadar, noble thoughts and ideas come across. We are not a closed society. We have been on the crossroads of civilization. We have produced great ideas, we have received great ideas. And that is the genius of India. That is what has kept India going. <laughs> Sir, I came to Parliament 50 years ago as an idealistic young man of 36. I now bid farewell as an idealistic old man. <laughs> because I have implicit faith that India will overcome all its challenges as long as we remain faithful to our constitutional and civilizational values. So, while expressing my deep gratitude for the unfailing courtesy and consideration I have always received from my parliamentary colleagues and for the kind words said by my colleague Gulam Nabi Azad and Ravi Shankar Prashad Ji from the secretary, the staff and the karamchari of the Raj Sabha, I will leave you with two verses from very different sources. The first is from Shakir Badayuni. Har cheez nahi hai markaz par. Ek zarra idhar, ek zarra udhar. Nafrat se na dekho dushman ko, shayad ho mohabbat kar baiti. And the second is from the Upanishads that have come down through the long and tortuous corridors of time for millennia. And that says, let us work together let us be nourished together. Let us achieve together. Let there be no hatred between us. Sahanavavadu, Sahanavavadu, Sahaviryam karvavahe, Tejasvinavadhi, Tamastu, Mahavidvishavahe. So, so it's a, so it's a last speech for this uh, term, but uh, it was really a feast. Everybody enjoyed it that way. Uh, Dr. Karan Singh Ji is retiring from Rajya Sabha, but he is not tiring from public life. He will continue to service. So, Janardhan Dvedi Ji.